So, <clears throat> I gotta start this by saying, just like with August's comeback album, you can hear the emotions and the pain and the feelings in every song that's on this album. Even if you don't like it, even if it isn't a good song, you can still hear it in this album. And these instrumentals are gorgeous. I don't know who makes his beats, but these instrumentals are gorgeous. Gorgeous. These instrumentals are elite. Elite. The worst thing about his death, to me, because I wasn't, I wasn't really a fan. I didn't like him, but I know he was one of the three people that a lot of people listen to to get through like depression, anxiety, whatever he was going through. You know, they got K. Cuddy was that person for people in my generation. Then they got Triple X, which is gone sadly, and then Juice World. Those three people are like. I don't even know what to call them. Because you don't find artists like that. You can't... You're just not artists that really, like, pay attention to the mind and depression and things like that. But those three artists, they just do... They just make music that people don't make. So that is the worst thing about Juice World's death. So, for anybody that needs their artist, listen to K. Cuddy. That's... Especially his older music when he first started making it big. Kid Cudi was that person for people in my generation. So, with all that being said, I wasn't a fan of him when he, when he was coming out. Because in every song, he's always talking about pills and lean and drugs and this. Like It, it gets tiring. It gets tiring. I'm tired of hearing about perks. We tired. I'm tired of hearing that. There's already a lot of people talking about that. And he has perks in almost every one of his songs. He talks about them in one way or another. That's why I didn't like him. But even though he still has a few songs like that on this album, this album is different. You can hear the pain and the emotions in almost every track. And there were a few songs on this album that I liked. So with all that being said, for the fact that you can hear everything in almost every song, I have to give this album a four. Plus he has some good songs, so it's not like there was a song that I listened to and it was like, this is trash, this is dirt. Which normally happens. There were a few parts here and there, but this album was good. That's what I'm trying to say. This album was good. For anybody that needs that person, listen to Kid Cudi, especially his older music. Go listen to Kid Cudi if you need that artist in your life. He is the man. Now that Triple X and Juice World is gone, Kid Cudi is that man. Go listen to him. Won't regret it. Maybe you might. Who knows? But give my man's cutty a try. He's the one. My 